All right, so this is my Revo 2.0. Um, I'm running the uh, 3.8 Proline Trencher X's. Um, these are great tires. They definitely hold up more than the Traxxas ones. They're a bit heavier, but as far as right now, I've had them for probably maybe eight, eight or nine months, and I haven't had any problems with them. I'm really, I really like them. They're, I really, I like them much better than the stock ones, but they're they definitely. With the weight, if you get water in them, then it's a pain. It's it's a very, very big pain. It's super unbalanced and it's just, your tires are all over the place. So today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to, to uh, there's two ways. You can either prevent it or uh, get rid of the water. So weighing our tires before we remove the water, we're looking at, wow, 20 ounces, that's, that's more than a pound. That's a pound and a quarter. That's that's a lot of weight for a tire. Like these stock Traxxas tires, I've been not they not wet, and those are fifteen. So that's that's quite a bit different. Uh, that's another that's an extra five five ounces just for these tires. Um, so hopefully, when we get some of the water out, it should be a lot better. So if you look closely, you can see a lot of tire wobbling going on and that makes it very hard to drive, so. so. The first way to prevent water is just sticking a piece of tape on one of those little holes um, and no water will get in. Just one of those holes right there. Um, no water will get in, but the tire will not be spongy at all. And that's fine for kind of some off-road bashing, but if you do a lot of your driving on road, not um then it's it'll be kind of a pain it won't it just doesn't not perform right so this is what happens when i taped the inside of the tires um it does not look right and it's super super unbalanced so i don't like to use that so what i'm gonna do is i have a solder um and i'm just gonna do four holes every 90 degrees um just on each side and uh, hopefully that'll solve the problem. Okay, so I'm done. Um, I just made really small holes and I made sure that they were nice and circular so um, they won't start to tear, but it works great. Um, I made four, four, um, four right in the middle and um, I can't wait to see how it works. All right, tires are all vented and uh, I've taken it outside. I'm just gonna give the tires a good spin. Um, See if it gets some of the water out. Okay, wow. Um, just for starters, uh, that's definitely working. I'm kind of soaked now, but a lot of water has come out of that. Just, just, just starting. So, let's keep going. So before I drained the tires and made the holes, uh, we were looking at 20, 20 and a half uh, ounces, and that's a lot for these tires. So go ahead and weigh them now. Okay, I see 16.26. Six, we lost over four ounces from water. Like they feel so balanced and like they feel, they feel amazing and they run so much better now. So that seemed to work great. Alright, that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching.